Yeah, Chelsea, this stems from incidents related to a separate investigation into Captain Danita Pettis. Now, this is an image of Pettis from a previous unrelated interview that she did with Local 12. Now, documents show that she approached several people back in April in question the validity, validity of a separate internal investigation into her. Now, one account in these documents says that the captain approached a sergeant at headquarters in the West End and then asked about this ongoing investigation. She wanted to know the order of interviews for for it, as well as how the department obtained any evidence associated with that investigation. Another report in the documents released to us says that Pettis lied on her time card and logged two hours of overtime, costing the city $191. Now, Chief Teresa Thiji would not comment on this specific investigation, but did release a, say, a statement saying in part, Members of CPD will continuously be held to the highest level of professional standards, both inside and outside of the workplace. Furthermore, when an allegation of misconduct is brought to my attention, a thorough investigation will be conducted by an appropriate resource to provide me with all the facts regarding any allegation of misconduct. Now, a disciplinary hearing was held, but the hearing officer had to take an unscheduled leave of absence, and the report has not been completed from that hearing. Chief Thiji says once that's finished, the appropriate discipline will be levied against Pettis. Now, we expect that to happen next month at some point. The findings against Captain Pettis, though, are administrative, so she does retain her full police powers. She's currently assigned as the commander of the records section.